what's up my beautiful fashionistas how are you doing wherever you are how is everything going on in your life today i just want us to talk about how to display your clothes or your items in your boutique if you want to increase your sales if you want to do more if you want your boutique to look really nice what should you consider what should you look at when you're displaying your items on a daily outside or even inside in your boutique so i have examples i've displayed some clothes already on the mannequins or on the dummies as you're going to be seeing and i'm going to take you through it and if you want to learn more just please keep on watching if you're new here kindly consider subscribing to yvonne winnie for ug and also please like the video comment below please share with us your views and also your additions to this video so that we can learn together and also share to whoever will find this video helpful so let us start so with this you have to consider a few factors and uh, number one you're going to consider the design of your clothes or the silhouette of your clothes then you're going to consider the colors in your clothes you're going to consider your target audience then the patterns in the clothes then also you have to consider the season which season are you in before you are displaying is it a weekend is it a uh, holidays is it the start of the year you know you have to consider such things as we're going to be seeing so with examples let me explain more here we're looking at four types of clothes so if your target audience is a corporate working woman and you want to attract her to come and buy from you maybe the clothes that she's going to put on in the week or something that you want her to pick for any day of the week uh, for example, this beautiful peplum dress, when we are looking at the length and the design in the dress, everything is just coming out very nicely. You're looking at the patterns at this display. The patterns are not so far from each other. And also, we are looking at color. We are seeing a lot of red here, and there is also black. Now, for example, if you are uh, looking at this first dress here, if you want your target audience, this uh, working woman, to put on such a beautiful dress, you know, any dress from here, maybe for her work, you have her with this peplum dress. If you want her to get a max dress, you have the dress there. So here we are looking at the design. You have different designs here. You have different length here where somebody can pick. You have uh, the jean as you're seeing it here, the trouser. Somebody might want some... Um, some attire for a friday evening you have had there all this uh kind of a mini red dress so you have uh you're attracting somebody with a lot of different uh clothes or attires so somebody can pick anything from here if they want a manda dress it is there if they want a weekend dress that max dress can do if they just want some color you have the bold red there if they just want you know a mix of patterns this peplum dress has some patterns and also the plain material the black uh part of it down there so i think you're seeing the vision what i'm trying to say here this display is showing your target audience or so attracting your target audience with color design and also even the length so that can be considered then here we are looking at bold colors there is only one dress on this display but you're seeing that that dress is not so far from the pants or the jumpsuits as you're seeing here the colors kind of all match they are not too bright and they are not too dull they are matching all together and the length i think you're seeing the length of the pants so the patterns are not so many i think you're seeing so you're going to attract your people or your customers to search or with such a display 
so also here guys i've brought in some other kind of uh same design clothes into this display i brought in this uh other green dress and it is matching with us with the dress that we displayed earlier on as you saw so the patterns are different but they are not so far from each other the Colors are kind of similar, but not very similar. We have some kind of red and green, but they are not real, real matching red and green. But I love the design. So all these dresses are max dresses and they're all cinched in by an elastic uh, along the waistline. I think you're saying they are all max dresses as you see, but the design is kind of the same. So and even this one, the color is different, but the design matches with the other two dresses. They are all cinched in along the waistline by an elastic. So that can be, you know, attractive to your target audience or to your customers. Then also the design at the top. I think you're seeing it is different. So you're showing them that you have variety. So you have to consider that also when it comes to the design. Then also, this is a dark blue dress. It is a wrap dress, as you're seeing here. We're still talking about the design. But still, even this one, it is different color, but the design is still the same. So you're showing them same design, but different colors. So you're providing to your target audience uh, a variety. Then also, this is a dark blue dress, but the jean is kind of in the same uh in the same color range so that is kind of light blue not so light blue but they are all in the blues they are all shades of blues and there is this black top it's just a simple top it matches with the rest you know black goes with mostly everything so it matches with the rest of the display so that is some of the things that you can consider when you're displaying your clothes so guys you can go different maybe in the design but then you mix the same colors you can go different lengths but then maybe the design matches so you have to consider such things you consider design consider color consider you know um the patterns in the clothes that you're displaying consider the day if it is a weekend which clothes do people want to wear on a weekend uh if it is a monday if it is in the middle of the week if it is a valentine's day you know consider such things Things and you will attract more sales into your boutique business so if you have any more additions please go on and comment below and that's all that i wanted to share today remember to like this video and also share it with anybody that can find it helpful so i think i'll be seeing you soon thank you